Hey everybody, Joe Conkley in the shop. Uh, this, it's been a while since I've uh, been live with everybody and uh, this is a, uh, an important day for me, of course. This is my last day here. Just uh, cleaning up the office as it were and uh, getting ready to retire my lunch. Trusty lunch bucket of 37 years here at Elderly Instruments and uh, we figured we'd better get uh, one more in the shop done. And uh, so this is uh, a bit of a, it's an ending in a new beginning. Of course, new beginning for me, uh, retiring from Elderly Instruments in the repair shop here. And uh, moving on to another segment of my life. Uh, one aspect of it is, is that I'm gonna be reviving uh, Conkley guitars a bit, gonna be doing some, building some guitars and such at home. So you'll see, uh, you'll, you'll be able to find that here in the next few months, see what that entails. But uh, I am just uh, wrapping things up here and uh, just wanna, for starters, say thanks to all the peop people that m made this possible over the decades from my wife and family to my family here at Elderly Instruments, Stan and Sandy Werben and Lily Werben and all the folks that I've worked with and for over the years, uh, all those repair clients out there, you know who you are. Um, I just wanna say thanks for uh, letting me work on your guitars all this time and I wanna say thanks to all the people that made this whole deal possible for me. It's been a pretty wonderful ride and I am excited to move on to the next step. So uh, part of that is trying to figure out, uh, are any of these tools mine actually? Do I get to take any of this with me? <laughs> and uh, which one those, ones those are and, and uh, leave a little bit of a clean slate here for the new team because uh, rest assured that all of your repair needs can still be taken care of here at Elderly Instruments. Uh, the new team with uh, Steve Olson, long time, my longtime assistant manager, uh, running the shop as the new manager here at Elderly Instruments and the same team that has been with you for decades um, from Scott Gehrman and Mike Hainerhoff and Carlos Montserrat, Kyle Zarek, and Mitchell Yost and Bryce, my new man. Uh, good team, still gonna be working with you solid. Same for the appraisal team that we have worked hand in hand with over the years. Frog and Larry Scott White and Drew Howard and Brian Alvarez uh, working hard for you here at Elderly Instruments. I, I love these guys and have a ton of confidence in them and the job they do. So let's go, let's go out here and see who's here today. Hey, Steve-O. He's gonna be holding it down for y'all. Steve Olson, the new manager of the repair shop, uh, doing what needs to be done. So uh, yeah, don't call me, call him. Ah, ah, ah. Now, uh, a little joke, but definitely, <clears throat> definitely the, the bottom line there. And uh, Steve and I have worked together for, so I've been here for 37 years. How long have you been here, Steve? 30. 35, so there, uh, for a couple of years there, I was on my own with uh, our old boss, TJ Thompson, and, and some of the old crew, but uh, we've stuck it out. And uh, uh, high time for Steve to start running the show and put his imprint on this business, and it's already happening, and I'm, uh, I'm thrilled to, to uh, begin the transition, right, sir. Yeah, man. Right. First of many hugs. You know, so let's 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 uh, keep doing a bit of a walk through here. Mike Hainerhoff uh, does not happen to be here today, but that is his station. Here's my man Carlos. How you doing, man? Yo. Carlos, be here helping you out with all of your electric and acoustic guitar needs. Eat anything, even all the way to shall I mention harps? <laughs> yeah. All right. Thanks, Carlos. Scott Gehrman's workstation. Scott is off today. 
And here's Mitchell Yost, one of my newest team members, even though he's been here for coming on a couple of years now almost. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah. Good, good. Yeah. Anything from neck resets to acoustic rebuilds. Wow. Patching that in. Yeah. There's the part that's left. But anyhow, yeah, don't there, your guitars. <laughs> there you go. Good advice. So, you know, looking to continue this whole idea of uh, social media videos to um, to give you a view into the in behind the glass window there in the shop to see what goes on back here. Um, we're, they're still in the process of trying to figure out what that new uh, show is going to be called and how it's going to work. But rest assured, there's going to be some new stuff coming out of this same. Uh, venue. Uh, and again, I just appreciate everybody that has viewed and chimed in with questions and attaboys for this video series. Um, we've had several breaks before in the past and the first one that happened, most of the breaks just happened from the natural uh, ebb and flow of business here in the shop. And uh, there was one point where um, I heard from our director of social media and our, our uh, uh, the statistics that we were receiving and, and sought out about how, what kind of impact our social media was having. They, they said, hey, somebody emailed in and wants to know where the shop was. And I said, oh, well, there's one, huh? So I appreciate you, whoever you were that one time, because uh, that was the joke. Well, at least there was one, and there was my, you know, my close relatives at home. Thanks, Mom, for watching the videos, that sort of thing. But no, I have uh, honestly found a lot of folks that have told me uh, just um, that they watched the videos and, and really enjoyed them. And I, I, I totally appreciate that feedback and really enjoyed doing it for you all. And that could be another aspect of it. Um, I've talked with my crew at Conkley Guitars, meaning my wife, um, about the possibility of uh, doing some videos from my home shop as Conkley Guitars, where I'll be starting to build some guitars here in the near future. Um, but all your repair needs will be met right here at Elderly Instruments from the new crew. So uh, thanks a lot, and uh, I'll be talking to you again in the future from the shop, Joe Conkley. Hey everybody, Joe Conkley in the shop. Joe Conkley here in the Elderly Instruments Repair Shop. Joe Conkley in the shop. Hey everybody. Hi everybody. Hi everybody. Hey everybody. Hi everybody. Hi everybody. Joe Conkley in the shop. Hi everybody. Joe Conkley in the shop. Fat Tuesday edition. Hi everybody. Hi everybody. Hello everyone. Afternoon everyone. Hi everybody. Hey everybody. Joe Conkley. Hi everybody. Afternoon everybody. Hi everybody. Welcome back in the shop. Hey everybody. Hey everyone. Hey everybody. Joe Conkley in the shop. Hi everybody. Hi everybody. Hi everybody. Hey everyone. Joe Conkley in the shop. Hello everyone. Joe Conkley in the shop. Howdy Facebook friends. Hi everybody. Hi everybody. Joe Conkley in the shop. Hey everybody. Joe Conkley in the shop. Hey everybody. Hi everyone. Joe Conkley in the shop. Howdy everybody. Hi everybody. Hello everyone. Hey everybody. Joe Conkley in the shop. Hi everybody. It looked like the screw. My right hand man Steve Olson chiming in here and keeping my information correct. Not only does it make the strings very high, you have to lower the saddle down to its minimum to get decent string length. Does. I wish I've never met you good. Of the grid. Bed, so you never big come neck, again. And it had a truss rod with no tension on it. And the other are off signals. My cane are off behind me. First thing. So this is it. Again in my arms. 
Bye. Bob White can share us on Facebook. We'll see you in a couple of weeks. Feelings. Feelings like I've never lost you. <laughs> and feelings like I've never had you. Hi, everybody. Joe Conkley in the show. Again in my heart. Feelings. For my life, I'll feel it. I wish I'd never met you, girl. You'll never come again. Nothing more than feelings Trying to forget you My feelings of love Again, thanks a lot for all your dedication and, and uh, just everything. Thanks a lot for everything. See you all later.